Hi guys, welcome back to another midweek shave. Here we are, Wednesday again. The weeks are just flying past. Um, you know, I don't know uh, where the boats in the world you are, but over here it's cold, it's windy, it's been raining, it's been snowing today, um, bitterly cold temperatures. So what I thought we'd do is bring some of the California sunshine over to the northwest of England. So what we're going to be using today is the West Coast Shaving Brush. Eh? Take a look at that. Absolutely beautiful, isn't it? My favourite brush, that. We'll put that in there. And we're going to be using the West Coast Shaving Retro Style Safety Razor. Take a look at that. Absolutely beautiful. It reminds me of one of those cars from the 1950s, maybe a Cadillac with the roof down and it's that colour and then the tail fins are this colour and we're cruising down that California highway watching Ken surf in his vest and his tattoos, yeah. Anyway, in that, uh, which we've already got in, you can see that all nicely lined up. We'll put that in some hot water. What we've got in there today, I had a lot of razors to choose from but I decided to treat myself. So we've got a treat, Dura Sharp Razor in there today. Uh, and the soap that we're going to be using, well, we're shaving products, Barbershop, and they have hit the nail on the head with this. It smells exactly like the barbershop I used to go in as a child, and that mixture of soap and barbicide absolutely beautiful so we're going to be using that and then while we're in the sun we're going to finish off in florida florida water if you've never tried this stuff it will brighten up any day really really good and for the balm we've got a trusted favorite alcohol so i'll wet the face and then we'll crack on with this shave here we go. Let's have a look. Well, this looks going everywhere. Oh, oh. Absolutely beautiful soap, this. Oh, straight away, the scent, it just fills the whole bathroom. So we'll get some. Hey, look at that. You just can't beat it, can you? Really, you're, you're wet and you're cold and you're miserable all day and you come home. I've said it before, a good shave, it can really really pick you up look at this like it's like like a meringue okay we're good to go we'll get some of that on the face so this brush is fantastic so how has your week been guys i'm not having a bad week pretty good got some new shaving products coming on order for the wedding anniversary that's it when you're into this hobby you never sure nobody's ever struggled to buy you anything do they anniversary sell i was watching ken surfs and paul h and kevy shades all oh, with the new um, fine aquamarine oh just want to get your hands on it, don't you? So I'm getting some for my anniversary. Okay, here we go. West Coast Razor, tree blade. First pass. Yeah, very good. It's uh, on the milder side. But, you know, I've got three or four days of growth and look at that he's taking that down a treat a treat yeah with a blade a treat okay. yeah so I was I was going to use fine in this shave but it would have just reminded me how annoyed I am at not getting my hands on that aquamarine. So 
so I may do it Saturday instead. But fines don't make a bad product, do they? There isn't. There isn't a single bad product. There's some you like less than others, but fines don't make bad products. And the scent on this stuff is absolutely superb. Okay. So, first pass done. Okay. Like I say, it's mild, but it took you, it's taken it down. Look at that. Yeah, that soap. Really good soap. I think I picked that up on the bargain table. At Pasteur's Pharmacy. I'm just like, I think I picked it up on there. Yeah. See the, uh, it was on there. I don't know why it was in there. On the bargain table, but I grabbed him. So, how's your week going, everybody? We're doing okay. Okay, second pass. We'll go across the ways. Yeah, like I said, mild razor, but it's taking it now. That tree blade. Treat blades, they're good blades, treat blades, but I find them to be a mild blade. If you put a mild blade in a mild razor, you get a smooth shave. But you can't really be aiming for BBS, can you? So, once again, how's everybody's week been? But at that stage, again, do you know, it doesn't seem like a week ago since I was saying, you wake up in the morning and it's Thursday and then you've only got one more get up before, before the weekend. But here we are. It's here again. And uh, I don't know if you can notice it, but I can't have my glasses there, see it? Like two little, uh, somebody said to me, uh, you've got soap. And you're glad it's not soap. I think it's the, the the light from the bathroom window, which is directly behind the camera, hitting my glasses. I think that's what it is, and not soap. <laughs> okay, so let's go. Uh... Yeah, the scent. The scent on this soap, superb. Really good. My proper childhood scent, I used to go, used to go to this barber's called Val's, which was just about two miles that way. Um, and we would walk in and you, this smell would hit you, you know, like I said, like barbicide and salt and brill cream and leather and the strop and everything. And, and uh, he, he would put, he had plank of wood and he put a plank of wood across the barber's chair and I would sit on the plank of wood. So I would be at the right height for him to cut my hair. Um, yeah, and then the real joy for me was that I actually had children quite young and when they were children I took them to Val's and Val sat them on the plank and cut their hair on it as well uh, and he, did, he retired shortly after that. Well, that was nice that they had that, you know. He used to cut my hair as a five, six, seven-year-old when he was cutting their hair as a five, six, seven-year-old, you know. <sighs> Proper old-style barbers he was. Absolutely brilliant. They're disappearing. You're getting all these new wave ones opening in England now. Everyone seems to be a Turkish barber, you know. But... Uh, It's not the same. Yeah, you're going Val's and you would have all these pictures left and you would have every single inch of wall was filled with something you could buy. There was um, mints and razor blades and newspapers and combs and cigarette lighters. And... 
absolutely brilliant. And when you open this soap and smell that, that scent takes you straight back, takes me straight back to Val's. And I'm seven again, sat in that chair, looking in that big mirror. Absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Yeah, wow, so it was mild. The rays is mild and the blade's mild, but it's all you are. Yeah, put it there. Oh, yeah. There isn't a lot left on the pickups. Yeah. It's just the usual, usual suspects for. Yeah, I'll do us. Put it off. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, oh. oh, that's brilliant. Just a minute, set these off. Oh, oh yes. Oh, that's brilliant. Get the blood pumping. Okay. Here we go. Now, Florida water. And you really are in Florida when you smell it. Absolutely fantastic stuff. And so cheap. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. I smell like an orange. Oh, oh that's beautiful. Oh. oh, this takes me back. Absolutely. Oh, cool. More great value stuff. Fresh, all these products all go together. They all they all complement each other. And that is that another shave. And if you're interested, the razor came in that box and the brush came in that one. Brilliant, good packaging. Hey, then. Okay, look at them. Another one, no cuts today. No necks, no weepers, no creepers. That's another one done, guys. Thanks for watching. Please click subscribe and like, uh, and I will see you Saturday for the fine Saturday shave. Cheers, guys. Bye.